Hey everybody, what's going on? Um, it's been a while. How's it going? Um, I got a package in the mail today from a very good friend of mine, Scott Costin Bromstar. Um, this video is not going to be titled Random Act of Kindness um, because as Scott put it in his video, these, these are not random acts. They are the planned out acts of friendship. Uh, so, uh, I'm opening said package, and uh, we'll, we'll see what Scott sent me. There we go. There we go. Holy goodness. There's a lot in here. A lot, a lot. Okay. Where do I start? Holy cow, dude. There's a card. We start with a card. I most likely will not read it um, out to everybody because it's personal. Oh, it's cute though. Aww. Thanks guys, we love you too. Okay, so, holy cow, we're gonna start with this. This looks fantastic. Uh, this is Genesis, uh, turn it on again. It is a live DVD is what it looks like. Uh, playing time approximately nine minutes um, of stuff that I don't really know because I don't know Genesis that well. I think I told Scott that. So um, live from 1984. So I was two when this was filmed, uh, but very excited uh, to actually get into some Genesis. All I know is like the stuff that's been on the radio. Um, and then, of course, Phil Collins' solo stuff, uh, I'm, a, I'm a big, big fan of. But, um, yeah, very excited to watch this. This is going to be a, a weekend, this weekend. And then, this is awesome. This is Rush, R40 Live. Uh, it says, 40 Years of Rush, the Ultimate Live Career Retrospective uh, DVD. So we got, uh, it looks like it's two sides. I, I suppose I can open this because I'm... I'm gonna watch it. Uh, doo -doo -doo. Rush is another band that I that I know f like criminally too little about. Um, so here we go. We got a little booklet. I'm terrible at showing this off. I'm not like Scott. Uh, so booklet with stuffs in it that I'll read. Um, God, I'm Scott. I don't know how you do this. Uh, anyway, and then DVD. This inside looks really cool. It's like the the light rigging setup for the stage is what it looks like. You guys can see that. That's awesome looking. Um, so lots of songs. The only one I know. I mean, the I know I know a few, but of course Tom Sawyer is the big one I know. So. Um, yeah, very cool. Looks like there's four encore songs. That's crazy. I imagine they put on a fantastic show. So very excited about that. Um, wow. Okay, we're gonna go with with these first. Uh, we have Belly King. Don't know. Don't know Belly King. Is it, is it, or is it, is King the album, or is Belly the album? Or, I don't know. I'm guessing the band is Belly, and then the album is King? Uh, let's see, 1995 from Sire Records. It seems like something I would look at. The first song is called Puberty. Oof. Very cool. Uh, and then Rush. This is Roll the Bones. I believe Scott... Yeah, I might be mistaken. I believe in a video Scott said this was his favorite Rush album. Uh, Dreamline, Bravado, Roll the Bones, Face Up, Where's My Thing, Part 4, Gangster of Boats Trilogy, uh, The Big Wheel, Heresy, Ghost of a Chance, Neurotica, and You Bet Your Life from 
There you go. Very excited to get into some Rush. All I have is a, a, a Rush vinyl. Uh, the Moving Pictures is the one I own. And this is just, look at, see these are all burned CDs. And there's a ton of them. Okay, uh, Stan Webb's Chicken Shack. Uh, I mean, seriously, have you ever heard anything cooler than this? This is going to be a, one I listened to uh, pretty early on in this. Uh, oh, awesome. Okay. Um, if, if you happen to see um, the video of, of what I sent to Scott, um, it was a package I had, I had curated around uh, Scott not really knowing Elliot Smith. Um, so I, I sent him as much Elliot Smith material as is out there right now. Um, so he sent me three Nick Drake albums. Uh, note on it saying, this is my Elliot Smith. Uh, very similar, Google him. Uh, so this is Brighter Later. Pink Moon, I have heard of this record. I have not uh, been able to listen to it. And then Five Leaves Left. Uh, various cool tunes. My buddy is on the Mance, is in the Mance Band. A cornucopia of delightful weirdness and overly neato tunes. <laughs> It says, this dog is not right. I love it. That's so funny. Uh, so, yeah, a uh, bunch of various um, songs from various bands. Very cool. Mance in your pants. I like that. <laughs> Wait, did that say? Marilyn Manson doing KKK took my baby away. Oh, that's funny. Wow. Wow. All right, lots of stuff. Jeez. Uh, King Crimson and the Court of the Crimson King. Um, if, if you didn't watch my last video of what Scott sent me, he sent me a King Crimson album that I, I adored immediately um, when I first started listening to it, and it's it's been fantastic. It's been on rotation on my... I guess not on rotation. It's been in my phone. I've been playing it quite a bit. Uh, but this is King, Crim King Crimson's first album. Very exciting. Uh, Steve Stevens, Terry Bozio, Tony Levin, Dangerous Intentions, Guitar, Drums, Bass Extraordinaire. Don't know anything about this one. Very excited. I'm, I'm always excited to listen to anything Scott recommends um, because we have very similar tastes. Um, this is Clutch, uh, Blast Tyrant, favorite Clutch album, Oh, mama. So there's that. We have Buckingham Nicks. Uh, Lindsey Buckingham, Stevie Nicks. Oh, there you go. And Stevie Nicks album they put out before uh, joining Fleetwood Mac. Very interesting. That'll be fun to listen to. Um, I'm, I'm excited for that one. Definitely. Uh, okay, Adrian Bellew. Uh, X guitars from King Crimson. Solo album, I'm guessing. And then we have Ainsley Dunbar Retaliation. Amazing blues prog band. Awesome. Um, that, that's something I guess I've never really touched on uh, very much. I'm a big blues fan. Um, anything that puts... Um, like guitar in the forefront I know which is mostly rock but um rock comes from the blues and I'm just a big fan of of the stories in those songs those are always fun uh like it um the vibrators British punk band classic T-Rex one oh nope 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 that one that sticker got on a different CD. So, British punk band, The Vibrators. There's another drawing. I guess I haven't been checking for drawings. Oh, I'm going to have to go back and look at them all. Uh, various European tunes. Too hard to define. <laughs> Metal? Uh, awesome. 
there is a lot of words on the back of this that I do not know. And it's fantastic. Here we go. T-Rex Slider. Uh, classic T-Rex, one of the best albums. So we got that. Um, I'm, not, I'm not very privy to T-Rex, uh, but very excited to give them a shot. Uh, Underground Heroes, British punk band as well. Sorry, I'm reading the uh, the names of the songs in the back. And then, uh, Yes, Relayer, my favorite Yes album. Yes is another band I know far too little about. So, very excited. Thank you, Scott, so, so much. I have some stuff... Uh, to send back to to send to you, not to send back to you. That would imply I'm sending you stuff that you sent me. That's not gonna happen. I have some other stuff to send to you though. Um, but there's a few things I want to get for you before I send it out. Um, but anyway, for those of you who are not Scott. Uh, go check him out. He's doing a great um, Countdown to Christmas series of videos right now, uh, and they're fantastic. He talks about stories about his childhood and, and music and movies and uh, just great stuff. He's, he's a fantastic guy. If you don't know him for real, go check him out. Uh, his channel link will be in the description. Fantastic, fantastic human being. Just an awesome person and there are far too few of them in the world right now so um go go check him out he's a great guy um that's it for this video uh thanks for watching again thank you scott uh and i'll see you later bye